All right, so I want to welcome everybody to tonight's webinar. Um, it's exciting. I'm excited. I always get excited launching new markets. Uh, we did this not too long ago, about a year, a little over a year ago, uh, with the United Kingdom and the Netherlands. And so uh, now we're getting ready to do it again with Germany. So I'm excited to be with you guys tonight. Um, so that we're not strangers, my name is Gary Stern. I am based out of Melbourne, Florida, not Melbourne in Australia, but Melbourne, Florida. It's on the East Coast near Cape Canaveral and Cocoa Beach. Um, I've lived in this area for a while now, grew up here. Um, let me do this too. Hang on just a second. I need to mute all participants. There we go. Excellent. So I know as people join in, I should have done that ahead of time, but I want to welcome you again. Uh, I'm from Melbourne, Florida. I've been married for 17 years now. I uh, have an awesome 12 year old son, super proud of him. He's huge. He's almost six foot um, and uh, weighs about 140 pounds. His favorite, favorite football team in the world is Bayern Munich. So for those of you tuning in from Germany, um, hopefully you're a fan of that team. If not, at least it's a German team that he is his favorite team of all the teams in the world. Um, loves the, he loves the goalkeeper, Manuel Neuer. He's a goalkeeper himself. So Excited to share this information. Just didn't want to be a stranger with you. Um, my background, just so you know, I was a, uh, a physio, physical therapist for about six years. I had the opportunity to work with professional athletes from all over the world. Um, Peekaboo Street was a, a patient of mine, downhill ski racer, helped her come back and win a gold medal in the Nagano Olympics. Um, while very rewarding, um, there were some things about that uh, profession and about that opportunity in particular that I needed to, to kind of switch around and to change. So, um, you know, my dad got sick with cancer, moved home to take care of my mom. Um, she also was diagnosed with cancer. They were separated, but, you know, literally right around the same time. And when I moved back here to Florida, um, things were different. Uh, I went into the pharmaceutical industry where I spent 13 years with a, a huge English company known as GlaxoSmithKline. Again, very big presence in Europe. So I know those of you in, uh, in, the, in Germany know exactly who I'm talking about. And um, I'll finish the rest of the story later, but I wanted you to know my background, my professional background before we kick in. And I don't want to waste any more time today. I'm going to go ahead and jump right into the presentation. So let me share my screen here for a second. I found that this oftentimes is the easiest way to share this information with you. And that's with... Um, literally sharing just a few slides. So hopefully you see me still in the upper right hand corner and can see what we're talking about today. Guys, we're super excited because I guess I should have started off with Guten Abend. Guten Abend. Hopefully I said that right. It's supposed to be good night in German. Uh, this obviously is going to be done in English, but uh, we're super excited about the pre-launch of Germany. Um, it's literally, it's imminent. It's less than a month away, less than one month away from launching a brand new company um, to Europe, to, to, to Germany itself. It's not a new company. We've been here in the United States for several years, and I'll give you the timeline in a second, but brand new in Europe. And um, look, guys, nutrigenomics, this is the study of how nutrition um, affects our genes, our gene expression in our body. So we're really excited to share this information with you. It's something different than you've probably heard of. I know you've heard of natural products before. You may have heard of pharmaceuticals. But imagine almost merging the two where you're using natural occurring compounds to affect the human gene expression. So let's dive right in. What, what are we talking about? Well, we're talking about oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is, um, think of it as rusting or cellular aging in the body, right? It's an issue that we've known about for years. We meaning those of us in the scientific and medical community have known about this for years and years. And it, it, the, the, you can see there in the example, I'm looking down, but the, the apples that they're showing you in this example, an apple that just sits on the counter, it can sit there for like a week. And sure, it'll ripen a little bit on the outside, but the integrity of the apple is still there. The inside of the apple remains um, you know, still fresh, let's say. But if you're to cut that apple in half and the inside flesh of the apple is exposed to the air, over time, that apple in like literally minutes and then hours is going to start to deteriorate, just like the example shows there on the top line, where on the right-hand side, the apple is shriveled up. It's, it's literally dying almost from the inside out because of oxidation. 
That same thing happens in our bodies. It happens to our cells. As humans, we all eat, we all breathe, thus we all produce what's called oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is cellular aging. And as you see in the example there across the bottom, free, our body makes three times 10 to the 23rd power. So that's a three with 23 zeros after. It makes that many free radicals every single day. And those free radicals attack our cell over and over again. They bombard our cell over and over again, literally aging and decaying the cell. Now, our body has a system of checks and balances to help offset this, but we're going to talk about why over time that declines and why antioxidants alone are not the answer. So let's jump into the next slide here, and that's talking about how big of a problem is this, like how bad is oxidative stress? They've linked it now. They, again, scientists and researchers, and I'm going to show you where you can go to get all this information. But scientists and researchers have found that there are about 300, 300 different diseases and dysfunctions related to oxidative stress. I mean, just look at that list there. I'm sure, I am positive you know somebody that has something, has an issue in one of those categories. I'm sure you do. We all do, right? For me, it was cancer in my mom's, in my mom's family and in my dad's family. Heart disease on my mom's side. Um, there was a stroke on my dad's side. So as I look through this list of things, I think about all these family members that have had issues along the way. And what if, what if there was a way to lower oxidative stress, which is related to all of these problems and thus slow this cellular aging process in the, in the process, right? Slowing this disease progression. I can't say that we prevent cure or treat disease with any of the products that we're going to talk about today. But I can tell you that oxidative stress is lowered and we're going to get into that here very quickly. So again, sticking with the problem, the problem of oxidative stress is one that's being heavily researched. Now, I know you're in Germany. This is the United States National Library of Medicine. This is called PubMed.gov. It's where all of the peer-reviewed research from all over the world, not just in the United States, but from all over the world, if it's in a peer-reviewed journal, if it's been done by, let's say, a university and reviewed by other universities and published, this is where that literature resides. Um, yes, a quick search of oxidative stress shows that there's close to 170, 170,000 studies that have been done on oxidative stress. It's a big problem, guys. And if you look on the right-hand side of the screen, you'll see there that the research is growing exponentially right now, not just slowly or a little bit, but growing exponentially. Notice that it's been in just the last 15 years or so that that research has really taken off. What, again, again, the scientists are realizing, what they're realizing is there's a huge link between oxidative stress and disease. Now, how can you alleviate oxidative stress? That's been the age old question, right? Historically, antioxidants were what were used. And if your body is making three times 10 to the 23rd, three with 23 zeros after it, that many free radicals every day, a one-to-one -one approach with an antioxidant isn't gonna be the answer. It's, it's, it's barely gonna put a dent in the problem, right? But that's what's been used for the last 30 to 40 years. And there's a new way, which is to activate the body. Instead of supplementing the body, why not activate the body? And one of the ways you can activate it is by activating a protein pathway called NRF2. I'm not going to get real deep into the science today. That's, that's in follow-up you know, questions, let's say, question and answer sessions. But for today's sake, for, for brevity, NRF2, nuclear reactor factor 2, is heavily researched. Now, you'll notice those results by year. The interesting thing to note was that 20 years ago, there was about three studies that were being done, three total for the whole year. 10 years ago, there was about 100. And just last year, there were 1,500 studies that were done, 1,500 studies. And you can see in just the last five years, the amount of research in this area has grown exponentially. Why? Because it's been found that activating NRF2 is the best way that scientists have found to lower oxidative stress or cellular aging in the body. So how do we do this? And this is our flagship product that we're talking about. This is ProTandem. ProTandem, 
again, a blend of five herbs. You'll see that at the bottom. It's five plant ingredients that has an 18-fold increase at activating NRF2. So again, on the example to the left there, you'll see antioxidants are listed, and there's a one-to-one -one ratio. You ingest one antioxidant, whether it's a juice, a berry, I don't care if it's a super juice, super food, it doesn't matter. One antioxidant binds with one free radical, both are eliminated from the body, one and done. On the other hand, taking protandum activates NRF2. NRF2 allows your body at the genetic level to express certain genes which produce those survival enzymes. And it's those enzymes that remove up to a million free radicals every second, every minute, every hour of every day for up to a week straight. One to one, one to a million all the time. And these one to a million enzymes that your body produces are constantly being replaced when you activate the NRF2 pathway. So you can see where it's a very efficient system. It's far better than the antiquated method of essentially using, in this case, people are using uh, antioxidants. That's like using a typewriter when we have laptop computers, which is what I'm talking to you through today. Or using um, pagers when we have these things, when we have cell phones, right? That's the biggest difference between the two. So we have that new technology. It's called NRF2 activation. Protandum is the way it's done. And it's proven, it's scientifically validated to lower oxidative stress or cellular aging by 40% in 30 days. You don't have to take my word on it. One of the major news networks here in the United States, ABC Primetime Investigative News, did an investigative news report on the company. I would recommend you watch that, like now. I mean, as soon as this presentation's over with, there's the link for you. It's abcliveit.com. It's a short nine minute comprehensive overview of what we have our hands on. It's dated. It, it's from 10 years ago from when this, this was first being studied. The interesting thing is now you can see what's happened since by looking there at those 23 peer reviewed studies that are available on pubmed.gov. PubMed again is the National Library of Medicine. So what are the five ingredients that are in protanum? It's simple. Green tea, bacopa, milk thistle, turmeric, and ashwagandha. These are herbs that have been used in Ayurvedic medicine, for instance, for centuries, centuries upon centuries, proven safe. And individually, they have their own merits. But when combined together, they have an 18-fold increase at activating NRF2. And remember, NRF2 is that pathway that turns your body's production of those enzymes back on again. In Europe, we have a slightly different formulation that substitutes the black pepper for the ashwagandha or piperine for ashwagandha. The reason is, is, is due to different regulatory reasons. I mean, in some countries, like in Japan, for instance, ashwagandha is labeled as a drug. In Mexico, milk thistle is labeled as a drug. So what we've had to do is we've had to change the formulation, prove that it does the same. It's, it's as bioequivalent, it's as potent at activating NRF2, but at the same time maintains that all natural integrity. So where can you go to, to back all this up? Well, Sanjay Gupta, very well-known uh, physician here in the United States, at one point they, they were trying to make him the Surgeon General of the entire United States. I think he said no but he's a chief uh, medical correspondent for CNN News. And he, he, he wrote a book called Chasing Life. It, it's, it's considered to be an authoritarian book in the world of anti-aging. And he dedicated seven full pages to Protandum in that book. You'll also see over there some of the universities that have studied Protandum. The fact that it carries the National um, Science Foundation and banned substance control um, seals of approval. What that means is that professional athletes, elite athletes, Olympians can all use these products. They've been tested, unlike most of the other products that are on the market, the all natural products on the market. Um, the American Heart Association funded one of the studies in, in the United States. So did the National Institute on Aging. In fact, that National Institute on Aging study, I'm going to bring it up in a second, is the one that stands out the most to me. Now, at the bottom there, you'll see a picture of a, a scientist. His name is Dr. Joe McCord. He's the recipient of the Elliott Crescent Medal. The Elliott Crescent Medal is given to worldwide pioneers that literally 
change the face of humanity with their inventions, like the Wright brothers, like uh, Henry Ford, like Madame Curie. So things that have changed the direction of medicine or technology. And Dr. McCord's actually the last recipient of that award. That's how big his discovery was at discovering enzymes, those enzymes in our bodies that slow the cellular aging, the same enzymes that protandum activates. Here's the research, here's the proof. 23 peer-reviewed studies, you'll notice the one there, number four, longer lifespan. All you have to do is read the first two words, longer lifespan in mice treated, so in a mammal. This is the first time in history that an all-natural product available for purchase has been shown to decrease, decrease the oxidative stress levels and increase the lifespan or longevity of a mammal. What that means is longer, healthier lifespan. Both, it's quality of life and quantity, not just one or the other. So I would encourage you to go, to go do your research, go look at where the research is housed and ask yourself if this research, not if the research is true, it's true, it's fact. Once it's published, it's a fact. But if this product has such amazing research behind it, who could benefit from this product? Who would this be the target audience? And you'll probably come to the same conclusion that I did. It's the world. We all eat, we all breathe. The air that we breathe is oxidizing the cells in our bodies all across the world, all 8 billion of us on this planet Earth. So we could all benefit from this product called Protanum. So here's a quick summary. And this is our flagship product. This is our flagship NRF2 product. We may launch Germany with a couple of other products. This is the one that I know you'll have. It's unique, consumable, category creating. If you're a business person, this is a business geared presentation as well. If you're a business person, ask yourself, if you had the exclusive rights and patents to distribute this product, it's first in class, category creating, you've never heard of it, your country has never had this available before, and now all of a sudden it's gonna be available where people can consume it on a monthly basis. What's the profit potential of, of, of having the exclusive rights to something like that? We are the nutrigenomics pioneer. There's no doubt about it. We have a complete approach to anti-aging, wellness, and performance. And again, we are the company that's backed by science. We're not going to sell you on marketing hype. We're not going to sell you on just pure testimonials. We're going to back up everything that we show you with good, hard science done at the university level, third party, so that you can, you can look for yourself and see and validate just how big of a product this is gonna be and how beneficial it'll be for the people that you love and care about. So I'm gonna share a quick video here. This is that ABC clip and um, hang on just a second. Let's see if this plays. You wanna get an edge on turning back the clock with just a few pills? Who doesn't? Well, it's no longer science fiction, but science possibility, a potential breakthrough. As I found out firsthand, there may be a way to erase years, at least inside my body. Granted, it's down the road, but some scientists are wondering if a new pill I took might offer a very long life. It may not look like the fountain of youth, but inside this nondescript building, I'm about to become part of an exciting experiment, a kind of guinea pig. I can record, okay. I'm here at the University of Colorado in Denver to meet Dr. Joe McCord, a world-renowned scientist. This is a pretty exciting stuff you're finding, huh? It is. We are very excited about it. His latest research could very well unravel the mystery of aging itself. And his decades of experiments may have the potential of adding years to people's lives and possibly prevent chronic diseases like cancer, diabetes, and heart disease. You want to get an edge on turning. Sorry, guys, give me just one minute. The video just stopped. You want to get an edge on turning back. Here at the University of Colorado in Denver to meet Dr. Joe McCord, a world renowned scientist. This is a pretty exciting stuff you're finding. Huh? It is. We're very excited about it. His latest research could very well unravel the mystery of aging itself. 
and as decades of experiments may have the potential of adding years to people's lives and possibly prevent chronic diseases like cancer, diabetes, and heart disease. It all centers around this small yellow pill, and for me, it begins with a blood test. It wouldn't be the first time I've given blood for this company. <laughs> they want to check my levels of something called T-bars, which is a rough indicator of a person's actual age. T-bars can identify a condition known as oxidative stress, a kind of measure of the wear and tear on our bodies. Oxidative stress, like the rusting of an engine, is not a good thing. Bad for the body, leading to disease. Leading to disease and leading to malfunction and importantly, leading to what we call aging. It is a slow progression of increasing oxidative stress. That's the main characteristic biochemically of the aging process. The problem of aging begins with the very food we eat to give us energy. As our cells burn that food, they also release toxic chemicals those chemicals, you may know them as free radicals, react with all the components of our cells, literally bombarding them millions of times per second, damaging all our cells. The result? Oxidative stress. And we all have it. The body fights back with a system of defenses. It makes two antioxidant enzymes, catalase and SOD, whose job is to gobble up the free radicals before they can harm our cells. So doctor, how often do I take these? And so, here I go. With that swallow, I've just become part of a potentially landmark scientific experiment. It's called protandum, and tests on both mice and humans have already shown that it revs up the manufacture of those good enzymes in our bodies. More enzymes, fewer free radicals to harm us. Right now, all we know is that this preparation decreases oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is not a disease, just like aging is not in itself a disease, but it's something that accompanies and is attached to, to many disease processes. So you can see the age-related... Normally, oxidative stress, measured by those T-bars, increases with age. But in Dr. McCord's tests, taking just one pill of protandum a day reversed that trend for everyone at every age, even for an 80-year-old they all are reduced to the level of oxidative stress that one would expect, frankly, in a, in a newborn or a very young child. High oxidative stress is associated with more than aging. It's been linked to hundreds of illnesses. It's at the very center of many diseases, liver disease, diabetes, emphysema, asthma. Uh, uh, I've studied all of these, strokes, heart attacks. Even mental disease. Yes. Depression. Alzheimer's disease, depression. Dr. James Crapo with the National Jewish Medical Center in Denver is also researching protandum for the company. But what about my progress? After nearly two weeks now, it's time to get my results. Dr. McCord calculates the numbers. The result, my level of oxidative stress has declined dramatically. 45%, that's, that's excellent. Just look at where I fall on the graph, before and after which if extrapolated back is, is the level you would see in a newborn baby. Would you suggest I keep taking the supplement? I would. Um, I can't guarantee it's going to extend your life. I can't guarantee it's going to uh, eliminate any diseases or cure any diseases. But we do know that oxidative stress is part of those disease processes. I don't want to wait until I'm 80 years old and find out that I should have taken it. So I don't know about you guys, but when I saw that the first time, I was like, wow, wow. Um, so sorry about the technical difficulties for a second there. You don't have to be a pro to, uh, to do these things, obviously. Um, but that ABC investigative news report, that aired once on national television here in the U.S., and it ignited the stock of our company because people wanted to know, where can I get my hands on it? So let me bring you up to speed now on how, how is it, remember I told you I was gonna finish the rest of that story of how I went from pharmaceuticals into this. Guys, I had incredible, amazing results with ProTandem that got me started on the Life Vantage journey. I took ProTandem though, not because of what I was gonna feel or because of what I wanted to feel with the product, I took it because of the clinical research, just like the physician at the end there says, he says, I don't want to live till I'm uh, 80 years old and find out that I should have taken it, right? 
I didn't want to be that person either. I wanted to slow the cellular aging of my body. I knew cellular aging was bad. I knew it caused oxidative stress and that oxidative stress causes disease and dysfunction. I'd lost my mom and dad to cancer and I wanted to do everything, everything I could to slow that cellular aging to the level of a 20 year old, just like they said in the video, okay? That's why I started on the products. But here's the other thing. I was working harder towards less financial freedom. I don't know about you, but my goal wasn't to work for my entire life to maybe enjoy just a few minutes at the end of it, right? Or a few years at the end of it. And I watched that happen to my mom and dad both working very hard their entire lives and barely being able to enjoy their retirement because it was cut short by their health. So I had a larger territory, less pay. I mean, they wanted me to cover this huge territory in pharmaceutical sales and it's a sick care industry. It is not a health care industry. They're not keeping people healthy. They're waiting for them to get sick and then treating the sick. And I was really, quite frankly, not feeling fulfilled by that. And I had to sit by the phone every six months just to see if I still had a job. I don't know if that is you. I don't know if you're one of those people that has kind of the world coming at you, right? Like Monday morning, people, there's more stress and more heart attacks on Monday morning than any other day of the week. And it can't be because people are making too much money. It's got to be that they are just stressed out. They have so much pressure on them to make money, to provide for a family, be it usually in today's day and age, both people in the household, both the husband and the wife, or maybe they're a single parent trying to make it work, right? And so that same thing, that was my mom when she was alive. She worked retail at, at a department store. She worked her guts out every day. And I wanted to be a different dad. I wanted to be the dad that was home with my son, the dad that was able to make memories every day to be a dad, not to have somebody else raise my children, but I wanted to be the one to raise my children. And I don't know if any of this resonates with you. I bet bits and pieces of it do because it doesn't matter where you live in the world. We all love our families. We all love our freedom. We want to be able to do what we want, when we want, with whoever we want. And I knew nothing was going to change unless I made a change. And so because I had this remarkable product in my hands with a company that has tremendous backing behind it, I knew it was time to go out and start sharing it with people. Little did I know that it would get as big as it did and within two years retire me out of pharmaceutical sales to the point where for five, almost five years, it'll be five years on October 2nd, I haven't had to go work a job. I've had complete time freedom over my life and financial freedom that comes along with it. So we're going to explain a little bit about that, but I'm not going to go into a lot of details. This is just to give you an idea of what we have our hands on. So this is, you know, your standard timeline. We're all born, we all die. And along the way, we, we have the first 20 years of life where we're learning, we're going through school, right? This is the plan that's outlined for 95% of the world. That This is the life they're going to live. You're going to be born, you're going to die, you're going to go across this timeline. First 20 years is spent learning. The next 40 to 50 years is spent working, working a job. Maybe you own your own small business. Maybe something happens and you're disabled and you can't do either. But the largest portion of most people's life is spent working. And it's only in those last few years, the last 15 to 20 years, that they can officially retire. And that's provided that you worked hard, saved up enough money after taxes, after expenses, after everything else. You invest that money so that it could then start paying you some kind of recurring income stream on a monthly basis, right? Maybe it's $3,000, $4,000, $10,000 a month. What if, or euros, since we are talking in Germany, what if that same timeline, same first 20 years, but instead for a short period of time, you earn and you learn a new skill, or a new set of skills, and a new profession. Something that you can do part-time initially start earning a little bit of income as you learn how to become a professional at it. And within five to 10 years with some hustle built in, you're able to build that residual income stream, right? You're able to build a business that continues to pay you month after month after month. Again, you could work your whole life, save money to develop a, re a recurring income stream, or you could work a short period of time, like 10% of that time, 
instead of 50 years, five years, and build a same recurring revenue stream so that you can enjoy the rest of your life. You can live and love your life where you want, with who you want, whenever you want, doing whatever you want. I mean, I was in Italy just this summer with the family, plans to go back to Spain again next year, probably going to be in Germany before then with the launch of this business, right? To be able to go do what I want, when I want, wherever I want, bring my son with me to go see a Bayern Munich game. Think about that. Does that sound appealing to you? Because it's real. It's real and it's possible. Here's how. Here's the timeline of our company. I'm not going to go into detail on it. I'll leave the slide up for a little while. And you can always go back and watch the recording of this. But our company was founded in 2003 as a publicly traded company. And by 2004, Dr. McCord helped formulate ProTandem. ABC investigative news report came out the following year. The stock went through the roof and the pr product landed on the shelves of retailers here in the United States, re traditional retail sales. By the end of 2009, after we had major publications come out and say that ProTandem was real, it was an NRF2 activator, it was a fact that it slowed cellular aging, and we got, uh, received our first US patents on the product, it was at that point that the company made the decision, we've gotta get this into word of mouth advertising, we've gotta put it into the hands of people. And they did that in May of 2009. And in the process, within four short years, the company went from two, uh, I'm sorry, went from $1 million a year in revenue to over $200 million a year in revenue. $1 million to $200 million in four short years. We've since launched other products. We've partnered with Real Salt Lake, a U.S. Major League Soccer team, to be the front jersey sponsor. We've brought on board the right corporate staff. Now is the opportunity as we expand into other countries for you to participate. So again, publicly traded company. We're traded on the NASDAQ here in the United States. It's, uh, we have a strong foundation already with huge growth potential. We've brought in experienced leadership at the corporate level who are familiar with opening some of our foreign markets. They've done it on numerous occasions with other companies, and we're going to do it with this one. Um, here's, here is that leadership team. Darren Jensen's our president and CEO. He comes with over 25 years experience in the network marketing industry. We've got Justin Rose as our chief sales officer. Ryan Goodwin's in charge of our marketing. So a lot of the rebranding that you see of the products and some of our technology, like the apps that we have and the, the websites that we're able to share to make it easy, to make it seamless. He's the mastermind behind that. Um, Dr. Peter Vertigan, that guy is amazing. He's the head of our international European markets. He's who's going to be on the ground, boots on the ground in Germany. He's German himself, and he heads up our entire European operation. So it's exciting to have him there to help launch the business, and you'll see the timeline in a second. Cortland Pearson is the head of all international. We have our chief sci uh, science officer there, Dr. Natalie Chevro. She's from France. And lastly, we have Dave Fleming. Dave is uh, in charge of our field development. He's in charge of helping develop our leadership out in the field amongst uh, the independent distributor team. So here's some of the facts on the German market. And I'd like to thank my friend, Annalena Stern. She, um, no relationship, same last name, but no relationship. She helped me put this together. She is from Germany. She is first generation in the United States. And so it's exciting. Many of you may even be guests of hers that are watching this. So it's exciting that, that Annalena helped put this together for me so that I could understand the German market better. We know that technology is rapidly replacing jobs. I mean, it's to the tune of almost 50% of jobs may be eliminated to technology in the next three to five years. Poverty is still on the rise despite the, the economy growing. That's due to high unemployment and the fact that the population is aging. Remember, people are living longer, but not necessarily healthier, healthier. So that puts a strain on the economy because as they live longer and they're not healthy, they are not able to work or contribute to the economy, right? And add in the fact that even those that can contribute that are maybe of working age, there's a very high unemployment uh, uh, rate. And so with that retirement benefits declining, it's a, it's a market where people need options. They need something to help them 
build a, a residual income stream. Quite frankly, everybody should have a residual income stream. If you don't have one, you need to ask the person who shared this with you to go over why. Because a residual income stream, should something happen to you, you'll continue to get paid no matter what. Um, the other big reason is that Germany is the fourth largest direct sales market in the world. I think it's the US, China, Korea, and then Germany. So the opportunity is massive. I've heard from some people, well, you know, people don't like these types of businesses. Well, they do in Germany because it's the fourth largest in the world, $200 billion exchanges hands in the direct sales industry every year in the world. And Germany is the fourth largest country in the world of that exchanging. Also $200 million a day is paid out in commissions. So couple that with the fact that there's a huge demand in Europe, in Germany in particular, for natural health and wellness products. People don't want pharmaceuticals. That trend is happening all over the world and it's even stronger in Germany than it is here in the US. So here's our timeline. We're gonna be having all, uh, business presentations throughout August. All of the presentations are from, what is that, 2 to 4 p.m. if we're talking in US terms or 1,400 to 1,600 hours um, in, the, in the EU. Um, they're gonna be live business presentations. So we're doing this right now to give you an idea of what the product is, the company's history, a little bit about the timing to encourage you to go and get the rest of the story. I'm not gonna cover all that here today. This is designed to introduce you to LifeVantage and to what we have. So Frankfurt on August 16th, Munich on the 17th, Hamburg on the 23rd, and Berlin on the 21st, 24th, I'm sorry, 24th. On September 1st is when we're slated for the official pre-launch of Germany. What that means is people could um, join us as customers and as business partners or distributors on September 1st. The official launch is on January 1st, but you can already be involved. You can already start building your story on the products and in the business as of September 1st. So God, we're less than a month away, hence the urgency in this presentation. Uh, October 7th through 8th, there's going to be a Leaders Academy there in Amsterdam in the Netherlands. We are already open in the Netherlands and the UK. Um, the launch plan is going to include um, founders and elite founders incentives. What that means is the people who are the first of the first. So the country is not even open yet. Germany is not open for business. But once we open, the very first people that get on board, as well as the first people that get to the elite ranks, the higher ranks of the company, there will be special incentives for those folks. Those are to be announced in the future. You won't want to miss it. There are going to be a couple of webinars. I didn't have time to add that on here, but webinars done in German by Peter, Peter Vertigam, our, our Dr. Peter Vertigam, our um, senior VP of international in Europe specifically. So I'll let you know when those are going to be taking place. Um, get back with the person who shared this video with you. I'll make sure that they know we have a, a WhatsApp thread that we're using to keep people up to speed on what's happening in the, uh, in the UK, in uh, Germany. Close with a couple things. We have a very simple system. We have a proven plan. It's literally like a step-by-step -step blueprint to build the business. Most of the folks who join us, our first timers. They've never participated in this business model before. We do have monthly uh, trainings here in the US, weekly training calls, on the job training and mentoring. That entire system will be transferred over to Germany. We will have the same thing on the ground in Germany as well. So there will be plenty of training to teach you how to do this part of the business. You have a complete team supporting you. There are plans right now in place, in addition to those meetings, for leaders from the US to be coming over and working hand in hand with the leaders in the German market. The question is, do you wanna be one of the first people or not? And so it's simple, we're building our business globally, literally with the click of a link on these, on our cell phones. It's simple, you can create a shopping cart for people, send it to them and they can check out instantly, instantaneously. Uh, that's not been done before in the industry where you can share carts like that. Uh, we have extensive reporting in our back offices with our websites. So a lot of that we can go over in detail in the business presentations. This to me is why I jumped into LifeVantage. First of all, everything sounded amazing to me. I knew I would be on the products for life. The key is I didn't want to miss out. 
I said, what if, what if this company really does take off? And when I got involved, we were only doing $11 million a year in revenue. We're over 200 million a year in revenue with plans to be a multi-billion dollar corporation when it's all said and done. Huge global expansion, and we know this. We know the first 125,000 distributors typically make up the vast majority of the commissions in any network marketing opportunity. In LifeVantage, we have less than 75,000 distributors worldwide right now. So we're still very ground level. It's a ground level opportunity that's established. We've made it through over five years. We're now, what, eight years into network marketing. So we're fully established, but still ground floor with nobody knowing about us. It's still not even open in the fourth largest market in the world, Germany. So we do have new incentives that are speeding up enrollments. Those details are gonna be coming soon. So it's up to you to make a decision, right? Get back with the person who shared this information with you. Go through and review it. Look, they're gonna encourage you to get on to the website. We can share the website in English. We can eventually share it in German. Many times Google will translate it for you anyway. Um, the thing to remember is you can only be first in a, in a country once. Only once, right? Once we do pre-launch September 1st, and then the official launch on January 1st, we're not going to go back and relaunch the country. You only have one opportunity to be first. So ask yourself, do you want to participate? Do you want to be part of the first group that actually is, uh, is pioneering this country? So thank you for jumping on today. Um, let me know uh, if there's any comments, questions. If you need any of that information, get back with the person who shared this information with you. I'll add you to that WhatsApp group. You can be kept up to speed on what's happening. I'm excited. You can tell I'm half German. I don't speak German, but my mom's family, all German. So I am so excited to finally be launching this in a country that I've always wanted to do business in. And uh, I'm encouraging you to take a solid look at it. We'd love to partner with you. Thanks for joining in today. Have a super day. Bye for now.